I mean, I think that we definitely played an intense game. We knew that we were going to have to match, even exceed their uh, intensity and their energy level. For some reason, William Smith really gets hyped to play us. It really seems like we're now rivals instead of it being um, like a skid more. Um, but we really worked um, all week um, talking about how we wanted to play them on defense. And I think our kids definitely executed that. Um, they were much more excited um, in the second half than they were in the first half. We kind of had a lull there um, where, you know, I went in the uh, second half and just told them, you got to want this game as bad as you want to breathe. And, you know, when you went suffocated, you definitely want to get that breath of air. Um, and, you know, it was a matter of us being able to put on our uniforms tomorrow or not. And so I'm so glad and so excited for, um, you know, our players that they played as hard as they possibly could for 40 minutes and that we'll be able to suit up and go to practice tomorrow. Yeah, um, in the second half, we really picked it up. I don't think we had, we had zero turnovers, and we gave up zero second chance points. And I think that's what was killing us in the first half was giving off offensive rebounds. Um, so we knew if we can cut that out um, for them, that's where William Smith gets a lot of their points. But um, you know, we really came together as a team. I think everyone who stepped in on the court um, made a positive contribution, and everyone was in tune on the bench. Um, so it was a great overall team win. Um, you know, really, it was our intensity and our and our energy. We didn't make any. Um, major adjustments on the offensive end or the defensive end other than I told you know Sydney Matoga that she needs to get involved um, you know I think that they um, she wasn't she was held to you know single digits in the first half and then pretty much went off in the second half um, and so I really wanted them to play with a fire play with emotion I know sometimes that you know they just kind of are there and they're playing hard but it's a big difference when you're playing with emotion and you're playing with excitement. You know, I wanted to see lots of high, high fives, lots of points, lots of fifth punts. That's what we're going to need to carry us into the championship game and even further. Turning and finding a box. Um, you know, we had to make contact. They crashed the boards extremely hard and they're athletic. Um, Jacqueline Murphy um, is a beast on the boards, but I think we did a really good job finding a box on her. And I think us pushing the tempo also tired them out a little bit, um, so they weren't crashing as hard. But um, a combination of that, I think, really helped out. I mean, Sydney and Hannah, they played a phenomenal game, and they understand um, the implications of this game. And uh, they have been in a position where, you know, they don't put on their uniform, um, but they understand the sense of urgency because if we don't suit up tomorrow, their college career is over. And so they really want us um, to get as far as we possibly can and to maximize our full potential. Um, and, you know, they definitely showed up. Hannah got easy touches in the first half, and, you know, I think she was at, you know, 13, 14 points in the first half, and that was good for her confidence. She struggled in the last, you know, two or three games, and so getting those early touches uh, – definitely boost her confidence and she was able to finish out um, the second half and finish out the game and then Sydney Matuoka this is her third game with 27 points I mean 27 must be her magic number um, and so she you know just definitely got after it like I said before single digits in the first half and then to you know come down and score 27 in the second half she's a phenomenal player and the seniors really really want to get back to the NCAAs and so they're going to put it all out on the floor each game